how do I split a clip? But essentially what we're talking about here is if I wanted to say cut this here or say I wanted to put something in the middle of this clip, how would I do that? So in Vegas Pro, it's fairly straightforward. For me, I use keyboard shortcuts and if I mention a keyboard shortcut, I will put it on the screen for you somewhere down there. So you press the S key on the keyboard, that creates a split and now I can drag this second half over here. So now you can see I've got a split in my timeline. If I click through it, you see that there's black there and these are both my bits. Now, just to demonstrate this, let's put, I don't know, a second or so between these, click here and play the video. So what you see is it went to there, then it cut out and then it came back. So that's the functionality we're looking for. How do I split a clip so that I can put something between it or so that I can cut a bit out very easily? or something like this. Now in order to, if I wanted to just delete this half of the clip, uh, which I will bring back later because I actually do want this clip, I can just hit the delete key in the keyboard and it disappears. Over to DaVinci, how do we do this? So the S shortcut on the keyboard is not set up for this. The simplest way if you don't want to set up a hotkey is click the blade edit mode and then click on the clip in the bit where you want to go. Now it's probably hard to see, but it's creating a, a red line in the clip. Um, and it's telling you at what point in the timeline it will create that razor blade cut. So you can cut there, um, go back to your, your selector, and then you can grab your clips and split them up like this. And it does the same thing. If you cut here, then you've got your bits. Now, personally, I don't like that. That's too many mouse clicks for me. And if I play this, it shows the same output. Yeah, so you've got splits. Personally, I don't like that. So what I did is I went into my DaVinci Resolve and I went to Preferences. I went to User and I went to Keyboard Mapping. I looked up for Split Clip. Now, Split Clip, for me, because I'm a, a Vegas Pro person, I came from Vegas Pro, I want that to be the same in DaVinci. So I set the shortcut hotkey to S, which is the same as Vegas Pro. And it comes up here to warn me that that's actually being used by something else and therefore I'm overriding that, that command. But that's fine, because I'm never going to use the uh, toggle slip slide mode. Not something I'm ever going to use, not something I ever have used. I'm not bothered. The command is called split clip and click on the shortcut and type in whatever keyboard command you want that to be. For me, I wanted that to be S. Again, I take my timeline, let's just say it's about here and a half. I press S on the keyboard and I now have my two clips that I can drag here and play. So for me, do the keyboard mapping, especially if you're coming from Vegas, it makes the transition a hell of a lot easier. That's how you split clips. So pressing delete does nothing. So your best option to remove a split clip from your timeline that you've, you've cut so you don't want it anymore is to select the clip so it comes up with this red out, outer line and press Control and X and that does a cut which removes it from the timeline without causing any ripple effect to the rest of your timeline. 